Hi guys, I'm Rick. Welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm making pork chops in a new wave oven. Alright, I'm starting out here. I have nine boneless pork chops. I'm going to season them up quick. I'm starting out by putting some garlic powder on these. And I really didn't use garlic powder until uh, I seen uh, a certain little miss on YouTube use, and I won't use any names. Melissa. So I'm going to season each side of these with some garlic powder, some onion powder, and that's coming out here awful fast, so I have to shake that lightly. I'll scrape that excess off that chop there so it's not so spicy. And I'm going to put some seasoning salt on. And you can use, let me scrape this off here quick. You can use any kind you like. It's that Tony Chatteries or however you say it. Now that I have my pork chops seasoned, I'm going to turn them over and I'm going to season the other side. And uh, I'll do that off camera so you guys don't have to watch me. And a few of these are still slightly frozen, but I'm not worried about it because the new way of bugging will uh, take care of that. Okay, now I have my pork chops seasoned and the side. In my new wave oven, I'm going to spray the rack here with a little bit of cooking spray. And it says keep this at the four inch setting off the bottom. And I'm going to line my pork chops up on here. And I'm going to try to get all eight of them on or all nine of them on here. That way I can do this all in one shot. And I'm going to give them like six minutes per side. And I say that should cook them the whole way through. I'm not going to be able to get them all on. I'll have to do it in two batches, but that's fine. Okay, I'm going to give this six minutes on each side on high. And when that six minutes is up, I'll flip them over and do the other side. Now, the first side of my pork chops are done, and I'm going to turn them over. And it actually took 12 minutes. Now, I don't know if that's because I have so many in here because they were still pork frozen. But I'm going to give them 12 minutes on the other side, and they should be ready to come out. All right, my pork chops are done. They only took six minutes on this side. So let's go ahead and fix the plate and see what we got. Okay, I also went ahead and I made some baked potatoes and corn for on the side. So there you have it. Pork chops in the new wave oven. Give this a try. I think you'll like it. And until next time, I'll see you.